Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In uh, today presentation and session, we will discuss about price adjustment standard procedure as per BC bidding documents. First of all, we have to understand what is price adjustment. Some people call it uh, escalation. So actually, this is not escalation. This is price adjustment. Sometime there will be escalation. Sometimes there will be de-escalation. So actually, this is the refixing of prices for certain items due to inflation or deflation. Why is price adjustment required? The government of Pakistan issued a formula for price adjustment. Before this, uh, the FIDIC and all other documents were being used for price adjustment for uh, constructor and bidder's compensation. Uh, PC Pakistan Engineering Council issued a standard uh, bidding documents for uh, price adjustment in 2008 and then uh, a revised version was issued in 2022. The motivation behind price adjustment is to minimize risk of contract failure and due to variation in items prices, prices are adjusted. So this is the uh, most important thing that in future if there is escalation or de-escalation to the employer and the contractor and the constructor disputes should be resolved with this price adjustment. To encourage the bidders to quote rate as per current market, let not like to forecast for 2-3 years that what will happen up to 3 years. So they should put according to the current market because the price adjustment is covering all these risks to avoid future contract disputes and litigations. Price adjustment applicability uh, according to a standard procedure, uh, the price adjustment procedure and the formula is applicable to the contracts having limit of 65 million, that is C5 uh, category of PC contract constructors. Price adjustment is applied on item having cost impact of 3%. Before this revised version 2022, it was 5%. If an item having uh, impact of 5%, it was supposed to be included in the uh, price adjustment uh, items. But now they have reduced it uh, due to inflation uh, up to 3%. Price adjustment applicability, uh, we can say several electrical mechanical works are covered in this uh, formula and even on highway machinery uh, usually imported also covered and the items linked with the foreign exchange. Price adjustment should be part of contract agreement. This is very important because most of the disputes between the constructors and the employers and the clients uh, arise at, a, at the time of time extension and uh, LDs imposition and this price adjustment. So it should be part of the contract agreement and should it should be clearly mentioned. Escalation shall be payable in full for original schedule period as per PC standard bidding documents for a price adjustment. Uh, this price adjustment or escalation shall be payable in full for the original schedule period. However, if some contract uh, is not completed, contract work is not completed in, within the stipulated period, then uh, price adjustment will be applicable beyond original period. However, price adjustment in the extended period shall be applicable in two cases in the frozen rate and in with the full uh, rate widdle and bricks and uh, manpower these were covered bitumen in road products these were covered in the older version however the as per the revised version the limit for the item is three percent so now uh, bitumen, tiles, cables, and do its aluminium section may also be covered in the price adjustment if this is more than 3%.
this is a, a typical not this actually the the, the standard this is a typical uh, uh, example or like a sample for the appendix C this is uh, uh, covered in class 70 of the price adjustment in the contract agreement as per PC bidding documents so according to the the revised version in the old version the fixed portion was minimum 35 percent but in the revised one it is 25 percent and the other uh, like items uh, uh, manpower labor steel brakes cement toils cables can these are calculated based on the engineer estimate the percentage are estimate but the sum of all these should be equal to 100 item which is calculation how we will calculate each item in the appendix C. This is appendix C. So you will like someone will uh, like uh, ask that how this steel is 16 percent, how this is labor is 10 percent, how this brick is 5 percent. So the cement, steel, all these things, how we, we can calculate? The procedure is here. This is actually written in the PC standard bidding, bidding documents. Item having cost impact of 3 percent is, is selected first of all. How you will select? Make an engineer estimate for all the works. Okay, then pick those items having impact of three percent. But cost item is calculated based on market rate, not overall. Like uh, uh, you will uh, take the rate analysis from the MRE system, and in the rate analysis, uh, the original price of the item will be selected. Like suppose we have steel. In the steel, like uh, one is the rate actual uh, rate of steel, the some are like uh, transportation charges, uh, overheads, uh, contractor profit, and like other uh, income tax, etc. So the original price shall be selected uh, of the steel, and that should be divided by the total cost. So this percentage will be calculated. Appropriate rate analysis of the constraint estimate shall be made to determine cost of the basic elements. Current rate is taken for material excluding profit overheads or construction cost. Each cost element determined as above shall be divided by the total amount of engineering estimate to determine various weightages. So this appendix C weightages comes from here. Now formula for, for price adjustment. This is the standard formula and this is very famous and, uh, and written in each uh, like uh, uh, in building documents and in, in this is like a, the part of each contract agreement uh, of civil work especially. So we have to understand all these terms. What is the, this P in? What is this A? Uh, B, this LN, uh, L naught. Like, so if you understand these coefficients and like these base prices, so it will be very easy to calculate the price adjustment uh, value. So what is PN? This is actually the factor, price adjustment factor for the work carried out in the period N. Let's suppose a, a contractor, a, a constructor executed a work in one month. Okay and that's value is uh, 1 million rupees. So how we will calculate price adjustment for this 1 million rupees? So we have to understand. First of all, we have to find this P in. This, then we will find, find the price adjustment amount, which will come in the next slide. Uh, here, P in, what is A? A is the non-adjustable portion. This is the fixed portion. Especially, uh, usually, uh, sometimes it's 35% uh, before it was 25% minimum. Now it is, uh, uh, sorry, uh, before it was 35%, now this is 25%. So, uh, various uh, minimum uh, 35 and maximum to 65. So, what is this B? B, C and D. Vertices of the adjustable items. These are taken from Appendix C, B, C, D, E, like we can go, etc. So these B, C and D are, uh, I will go to this here, uh, 
again this suppose for contractor this is uh, labor 10 percent so this is actually the b for steel this uh, c is suppose 16 for brick this is d is 5 suppose e is uh, another item 10 then f then uh, g h i j so these are the base uh, like the, the weightages coming from here we should understand this uh, b c d okay this shall be rounded up to two decimals actually uh, when we, we are calculating so this uh, the appendix c should be in two decimal this understand uh, uh, is standard procedure okay now if we sum up all this like i told you there's a plus b plus c plus d plus e f g h like all the items should be one or hundred percent okay so uh, like uh, the, uh, the, the 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 summation of all these uh, factors should be equal to one if we come here so this uh, weightages from the top to bottom should be equal to hundred percent or it should be one okay which is one uh, then coming again okay the sum uh, okay this l naught m naught e naught these are like uh, the the base uh, coefficients uh, these are the base date prices what are base date prices for the specified items when uh, some bids are open financially bids are open and uh, suppose today is uh, uh, 21st june so before like a 28 days back this is the rate of the item 28 days back so i have to go to uh, may may uh, 18 or may 19 uh, i should take the rates of uh, may this is the in not the base rate of our in item and the i the top one ln or mn these are the current rates these are the current rates actually it's not written but ln mn en are the current rates and l not m not e not are the base rates for any item suppose steel today is uh, two 50,000 rupees 250,000 rupees and it was before two years before it was 100,000 rupees so 250 100, uh, divided by 100,000 so it will be like this and the base the base B is the uh, weightage weightages okay what how will uh, you will uh, do final calculation of the price adjustment if suppose we have a an amount of P uh, payable to the contractor before escalation. Contractor has, has executed a work of P payable. Then we will calculate the uh, P in uh, with this formula. When we will calculate P in, so this P will be multiplied with the P in, that will be the payable uh, price adjusted amount. So uh, now this is easy a value of p executed by the contractor okay any amount suppose contractor has executed one million uh, one million work and we calculated this p in as 1.2 or 1.5 or, 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 or 0.0 or 0.2.5 okay this is actually the p in so the payable amount to contractor for work in the period n shall be equal to p in multiplied by p for the purpose of calculating PN, the coefficient for each item shall be used irrespective of the actual constituents of the work performed during the billing period. So each item should be should be constituted. Maybe uh, the contractor has executed a work of just ten percent, or uh, the cement work is eighty uh, percent. Uh, but we have to put all the items. This is the standard procedure. So this this PAA is price adjusted amount. This is price adjusted amount. This should be equal to P in multiplied by P. I think uh, this is very simple. Uh, thanks and shukran. Actually, uh, I will prepare a spreadsheet online. 
on this uh, escalation and will share for the you know for the uh, easy way of price adjustment calculation thank you so much any question and recommendation are most welcomed allah hafiz